it was a meeting full of energy and diversity, a new task force launched by the state's Division of Economic Development with a goal of making New Hampshire, which is 94 percent white, more friendly and welcoming to a wider range of people. That we can say, you know, come to New Hampshire. We have wonderful attributes, but we also um, welcome diversity and inclusion. We want you to bring our young families and your skills here to this state. But Anthony Shanella, the communications director for the state's Department of Education, took issue with the event, which was covered by the New York Times. On his personal Facebook page, he responded to the report, saying, quote, Northern New England is the way it is because we're the only people who want to be here. We're very welcoming, see the Free State Project, but don't come here if you're going to change everything. We like it the way it is, which is why we are here and not where you live. He later added, quote, we don't want or need New Hampshire to become any kind of cesspool. He also made reference to a hypothetical, quote, 1,300 illegal alien Dominican drug dealers moving from Lawrence to Concord. Asked for comment by News 9's John DeStaso, Chanella said he was talking about the future of the workforce. Quote, the issue is, how do we retain young people to live in the state? It wasn't about race at all. But Governor Chris Sununu believes Chanella's comments crossed a line. Thursday morning, he said, quote, statements like these are unacceptable and wrong. I am confident that Commissioner Edelblue will take appropriate disciplinary action. Democrats are calling for Chanella's resignation. Members of the new diversity task force say, at the very least, he could reach out. Just establish relationships with people uh, that are different uh, in any way, shape or form to him and uh, learn to see people as human beings. In a statement, Education Commissioner Frank, Frank Edelblue said, quote, I and the Department of Education condemn this statement and any racist statement. The department is taking all appropriate and available disciplinary actions under state law. Chanella is a classified state employee, which means Governor Chris Nunu does not have the power to fire him. Reporting live in the newsroom, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.